any under one, you've got to be looking for the rib fracture. And this is what I do. I start at the top, and for whatever reason, I start on the left. Um, and I always look at the posterior portions of the rib from medial to lateral, each one going down all the way to the bottom. And then I start at the turn of the lateral portion and move to the costochondra junction, and I do that individually. And then I go over to the other side and do the same. And when we get down here, we see that this rib is expanded. There's lucency underneath that lifted bit of periosteal reaction, and actually with the eye of faith you can see a little rib fracture in there as well. This is never normal, okay? Either it's because of inflicted injury or it's because of handling in bones that are um, soft and weak um, for another reason causing a fracture. But either way they need to be further investigated.